there will be total insecurity in Nigeria if the federal government fails to work on reducing poverty level. Primates are your daily wants again. The spiritual leader of Irie Evangelical Spiritual Church, Primate Elisha Hayodele has urged the federal government of Nigeria, led by President Bola Mentinobu, to work on scaling down the poverty level in the country. Primate Hayodele, who spoke via the latest edition of his Compendium of Messages from God for the year 2024, noted that the level of poverty in the country is not commensurate with the solution being provided by the government. According to him, the poor solution being put forward to manage the poverty level in the country is eating the polity. He added that it will eventually cause hyperinflation. If the government does not reduce the level of poverty in the country, there will be total insecurity. The government must work on issues that will not threaten security and provide solutions to economic problems for the, sec for the country to forge ahead. The Spirit of God says insecurity will bring more inflation if the government does not handle things as expected. I foresee that this way, the police and the army will protest, especially people at the war zone. They will protest because of irregularities in their salaries. Well, the protests have already started. Yes, they have already started. Okay, whether we like it or not, make we just forget about uh, in the talk prophecy from God. Without you, without, without anybody telling you, pastor or prophet, or Babalawo says, uh, God or the gods showed them or told them what this and this and that. You should understand that these things will happen. You understand? If the country did not manage, you know, the poverty level, that is the truth. That is the truth. People will go into criminality. So, Nigeria as a country should set a goal for itself. Nigerians are not asking much now. What are they asking for? Nigerians are not asking much. Save our life from insecurity for those people who will come and take off our heads or come and, uh, you know, kidnap us from, for nothing. We need insecurity. Guide us. Protect, please, I'm, protect us, I meant to say, from these criminals. Let the economy be okay so that we can be able to feed. We can be able to send our children to school. Let there be employment for the youth. These three things, the government should look into it. Because when I'm saying this, I am seeing a lot of um, reactions here. People are saying, Yahoo prophet. People are saying this, this, and this, and that. Make we forget, say, instead of prophecy. Even if person not tell you, say, God talks, say, you should expect that these things will happen. You understand? These things will happen. Let us forget about God, say, or whosoever that directs anybody. If the government do not work on these things, a time will come, people will be looking for Nigeria because we are going to that, to that end right now. Today, dollar is being sold in the black market for 1,500. 1, People cannot, can hardly eat three square meals in a day. The government have increased school fees for the children. Transport fare has been increased. You can't buy anything in the market. Now, salaries are still remaining there. Like that, it has not been increased. How do you want people to survive? Those people, when they say they get the mind of criminal, criminality before, and they never say how they won't take activator, with all this suffering and all that, they go activator. That is the truth. We should start telling ourselves the truth. The government have to do something. You know, 
to say Emmy Loco, it no be, it no be, it no be joke. Not just to say it. Now your time, now your turn. You have to walk. You understand? Because with the look of things, since twenty twenty three March twenty nine, now Nigeria don't hit wahala be this. Since the day the Nigerian president was inaugurated, you know, as a Nigerian president, when he say first sunset is gone, that was the day Wahala hit Nigerians and Nigeria as a country. Now, insecurity have become the order of the day. People are not going into kidnappings because it's pain. You understand? It's pain. Then they talk, say, and I am... Um, I do mind is, is devil's worship, right? When people are not being engaged, when people are not doing anything, they will begin to think so many short, short ways to get money. You get, you understand. And these are the things the government will try to look into. We also talk about the salary of police and Nigerian army, Nigerian soldiers. If the government do not look into all these things, don't forget that they are with arms. So they can easily do whatever they like with it. You understand? So the government have to look into their salary structure. If I could remember during answers, these are one of, you know, the reasons why Nigerian youth uh, protest. These are one of the reasons. They protested for that. But the same people who they were, you know, helping to say, I beg, make them improve their salary. May they not see everybody, you know, on the road as a, a criminal, begin to molest you or whatever. What's your take on what he has said? Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you.